Hi guys, today I have another P.O. Box opening video and this package is from someone called Dahlia and I'm just covering her address here but I've been talking to her on Instagram and she asked if she could send me a package to do an opening video and I said of course so she sent me this package and here is the back and it's really cute, it has some Sumiko Gurashi deco tape here and also some drawings and it says cute popo so I'll be opening this so I took everything out and there's some really cute memo paper here and it says some clay I hope you like it so I'm curious and here oh there's some bunny stickers and they're so cute I love bunnies and here are some bears so I think I'll try to take these out so I think I should read her note first I almost forgot so here it is so thank you for the note I just read it and she said her name is Dahlia and she loves to work with clay and here she leaves her Instagram and Facebook and other social media and her username is Danipo2 sorry if I am pronounce it wrong but thank you so much and she also sent me this business card so here are the stickers that I showed earlier so there's some really cute bears and these puffy bunny stickers so thank you and some memo paper I believe oh and there's more here so Sumiko Gurashi and Yudakuma so here it says there's some clay so I hope she included her handmade charms because I've seen them on Instagram and they were super cute oh and this is a Hello Kitty package Wow, they're so tiny, so let me take all of them out. Wow, your charms are so tiny and perfect. They're super cute, so I'm gonna show you one by one. And the package is really cute. She used uh, memo paper for the little tag, so I think I'm gonna leave them like this for a while. So here is Adirakuma, and it's super small. And then here I have this adorable bento box and this is the one that I saw. This is the image that she sent me and it's really cute. I think I'm gonna open this one. So here's her bento box and it's super detailed and tiny. So Ridakuma is the onigiri and there's some vegetables and an egg here. This is adorable. And then here, there's a hamburger. It's even some tiny sesame seeds. This is really cute. And also a tiny hot dog. And then here, I have a Rirakuma and a Kurirakuma head. And Kurirakuma is sleeping. So here's a fried egg and a bacon. And these are so realistic. Can you see the egg? Even it's a little burnt on the edges. And here is another miniature and it's a tiny banana split. Next there's this chocolate donut and a purple macaron. This is really textured on the sides. And here there's some other pastries. So a cupcake, a chocolate donut that is super tiny in comparison to my nail and this tiny croissant and this bread 
be really good at making realistic things. I can never make these. And next there's this cute dongle with different faces. Super cute. And next there's this creamsicle with a bite taken out and he has a cute face too. And last, there's a bunch of little things here. I think I'm gonna open this as well. So here's a tiny chocolate bar and it has some silver wrapping and he even has some eyes and that's so adorable. And here there's a game that looks like BMO. I think it's BMO. It's super tiny too. And here are this two adorable Sumiko Gurashi characters. So I'm sorry if you can't see very well, but they're so tiny my camera. It's having a hard time focusing. But here's the penguin and the tonkatsu. He's so cute. They're so tiny. I'm afraid I'm gonna lose them. So I think I'll leave them in their package. So here are Dahlia's tiny and adorable charms and sorry if I kept repeating myself but they're just too cute and tiny. And Dahlia, thank you so much for everything you sent me and again I'll leave her links and everything down below so you guys can check it and thank you so much for watching, bye bye!